Thanks to Stoon for those opening seven races. And I'll start then with the Bright House Novices Chase over two miles and one furlong. Uh, the top one is the glider for Joshua Sutherland, Corletto Pertico, Darren Thompson, Guna Getaway for Graham Clutterbuck, Nashville Eddie Alvin, Gerard Royal Salute, Craig Beckwith, Rule the Seas for Paul Rhodes, Jewel in the Crown, Jim Murray, and Remain Truly on Van Rensburg, calling it away, uh, making their way towards the first of the fences in this one. 11 to take overall, and Rule the Seas is in the lead by about a neck. To the glider in second. Nothing seems all that keen to lead at this stage, though. And there's probably only three lengths first to last, in fact. They're virtually all in a line, aren't they, with the exception of the first two? Rule the seas and the glider. And all the seas just being pushed on there to lead by about a length and a half. To the glider in second. Just about showing third is Nashville Erigal on the inside of Remain True as they finally get to the first, which they all safely negotiate. And now making the way towards the second, the glider was a little bit slow at that first and has subsequently shuffled down the pack a little bit. But there's still a lot of racing and a lot of jumping to be done as they get to the second. And the glider jumped that one much better. Corletto Pertico, just the current back marker, but rule the seas. Oh, Paul Rhodes is in the lead by two to Guna Getaway in second. And then remain true in third on the inside. And on the inside of that one, the green jacketed Nashville Eddie Gal, and then right on the rail, the glider is now smooth, smoothly running right away through again into a share of third as they get to the third. I know that one the mistake was by Leon von Rensburg, who to remain true. Corletto Pertico continues at the back, and it's ruled the sea, ruled the seas. He continues to lead as they get to the that really good jump there by the glider. They've seen that one jump. Not just upsides, but even into the lead as they get over that ditch, which comes up pretty quickly again. Remain true was slow, but all the Caesars regain the lead from the glider in second, and Nashville Aragal is third. Going to get away for Royal Salute, getting into it is fifth on the outside. Jordan the Crown just being passed by Remain True, and Corletto Pertico is now starting to make a forward move as well. They've got a Malta race, and they make this left handed sweep now with all the seas clear by two to Nashville Erigal in the two shades of green on the inside another good jump there by the glider after that early mistake it's jumped really well so far and Corletto Pertico is moving through the field really well as well and jumped into third place there a mistake by Nashville Erigal but all the seas is in the lead with the glider on the outside, Corletto Pertico is now moved right up into the third. Then comes Guna Getaway. Over the eighth they go. Another mistake. My remain true. And Rule the Seas continues to lead by length. The glider is second. Royal Salute's come through in third. Corletto Pertico now being pushed along again in fourth. Guna Getaway on the outside. They've only got four and a half furlongs to go. This is the third last. And over it they go. And it's Rule the Seas who's still in the lead with a glider. Looks to be going really nicely in second. Royal Salute being pushed along in third. Nashville Erigal is trying to run on Corletto Pertigo looking a bit one pace now remain true still there despite the mistakes but it's Rule the Seas who's three clear Rule the Seas then he's going to swing into the straight then with two more fences to take and a lead now probably the biggest lead it's had in the race so far of about four lengths from in second place the glider who's been hard ridden then comes Raw Salute on the outside Nashville Harrigal Corletto Pertigo trying to get here again over the second last and the leader was slow and the glider was fast and the glider is coming through to challenge Rule the Seas Corletto Pertigo Nashville Harrigal these four remain true on the outside is now trying to get into it despite all those mistakes they come down towards the final fence and Corletto Pertico hits the front Corletto Pertico better jump again by the glider Nashville Aragal between the two it's Nashville Aragal who's just beginning to go on now Nashville Aragal by half a length and racing up towards the line it's got to be Nashville Aragal the glider one last lunge when Nashville Aragal takes it from the glider remain true finished fast run Portico Corletto Portico was after that and rule the seas drop right out the back. But it's Nashville Erigal for Vinnie Gerard that takes it. The glider for Joshua Sutherland second. Corletto Pertigo. Darren Thompson was third. Remain true for Leon Van Rensburg fourth. And Jordan the Crown for Jim Murray was fifth. <laughs>